Good afternoon. Welcome to the Daily Office, and thank you for joining me. This is evening prayer for Saturday, November the 24th. The scripture for this service, Psalm 33, Malachi chapter 3, verse 13 to chapter 4, verse 6, and a canticle from Deuteronomy chapter 32, verses 1, 3, and 4, 9, and 10, and 12. O oh God, come to my assistance, make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as at the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Ring out your joy to God the Most High, O oh, you just, for praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Alleluia. Psalm 33. Alleluia, ring out your joy to God the Most High, O oh, you just, for praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Give thanks to our God upon the harp. With a ten-string lute play your songs. Sing to our beloved a song that is new. Play loudly with all your skill. For your word is faithful, and all your works are done in truth. You love justice and right, and fill the earth with love. By your word the heavens were made, by the breath of your mouth the stars. You collect the waves of the ocean, and store up the depths of the sea. Let all the earth fear you, all who live in the world stand in awe. For you spoke, it came to be, you commanded, it sprang into being. You foil the designs of the nations, you defeat the plans of the peoples. Your counsel stands forever the plans of your heart from age to age. They are happy whose God is Yahweh, the people who are chosen as your own. From the heavens you look forth and see all the peoples of the earth. From the heavenly dwelling you gaze on all the dwellers of the earth, you who shape the hearts of them all and considers all their deeds. A ruler is not saved by his army, nor a warrior preserved by his strength. A vain hope for safety is the horse. Despite its power, it cannot save. Our God looks on those who fear God, on those who hope in God's love, to rescue their souls from death, to keep them alive in famine. Our souls are waiting for you, God. You are our help and our shield. Our hearts find joy in you, we trust in your holy name, and may your love be upon us always, O beloved, as we place all our hope in you. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Bring out your joy to God, the Most High, O you just, for praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Alleluia. The lesson is from the prophet Malachi, chapter 3, beginning at verse 13. You have spoken harsh words against me, says Yahweh, and yet you say, how have we spoken against you? You have said, is it, it is vain to serve God. What do we profit by keeping his command or going about as mourners before Yahweh of hosts? Now we count the arrogant happy evildoers not only prosper, but when they put God to the test, they escape. Then those who revered Yahweh spoke with one another, and Yahweh took note and listened, and a book of remembrance was written before him of those who revered Yahweh and thought on his name. They shall be mine, says Yahweh of hosts, my special possession on the day when I act. And I will spare them as parents spare their children who serve them. Then once more you shall see the difference between the righteous and the wicked, between one who serves God and one who does not serve God. See, the day is coming, burning like an oven, when all the arrogant and all the evildoers will be stubble. The day that comes shall burn them up, says Yahweh of hosts so that it will leave them neither root nor branch. 
But for you who revere my name, the sun of righteousness shall rise with healing in its wings. You shall go out leaping like calves from the stall, and you shall tread down the wicked, for they will be ashes under the soles of your feet. On the day when I act, says Yahweh of hosts. Remembering the te remember the teaching of my servant Moses, the statutes and ordinances that I commanded him at Horeb for all Israel. Lo, I will send you the prophet Elijah before the great and terrible day of Yahweh comes. He will turn the hearts of parents to their children and the hearts of children to their parents, so that I will not come and strike the land with a curse. Here ends the lesson. Show us your mercy, O God, and grant us your salvation. Clothe your ministers with righteousness. Let your people sing with joy. Give peace in Jerusalem and in all the world, for only in you can we live in safety. Keep this nation in your care. Guide us in the way of justice and truth. Let your way be known upon the earth, your saving help among all nations. Let not the needy, O God, be forgotten nor the hope of the poor taken away. Create in us clean hearts and sustain us by your Holy Spirit and for all of your intentions. Our beloved which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Alleluia! Give ear, O heavens, and I will speak. Let the earth hear the words of my mouth. Alleluia. A song from the book of Deuteronomy. Alleluia. Give ear, O heavens, and I will speak. And let the earth hear the words of my mouth, for I proclaim the name of Yahweh. The rock, your work is perfect, and all your ways are just. A faithful God without deceit, just and upright are you. Your own portion was your people, Jacob, Leah, and Rachel, your allotted share. You sustained them in a desert land, in a howling wilderness waste. You shielded them and cared for them, and guarded them as the apple of your eye. You alone guided them. No foreign god was with them. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Give ear, O heavens, and I will speak. Let the earth hear the words of my mouth. Alleluia. Bless Jesus, my soul, and may the God of hope fill us with all joy and peace in believing through the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia.